Ajata Kamara is one of the 20 winners for the Women in Science Initiative of the L'Oreal Foundation and UNESCO, which aims to give visibility to women researchers worldwide. The 25-year-old Ivorian was chosen for her work on biopesticides to protect yam crops, a route that is highly prized in sub-Saharan Africa. It allows me to show my research to other women, to other countries, and it puts a little pressure on me because I tell myself that now I have to be a role model for young girls in science. Ajata further explained that her goal is to develop biopesticide based on plant extracts, fungi and beneficial bacteria in order to treat plant without using actual chemicals. I work on the development of biopesticide based on plant extracts, bacteria and also fungi. But these bacteria and fungi are said to be beneficial. And so I'm trying to find methods to control the fungi that attack post-harvest yams. Her passion for research stems from her childhood when her father's mango crops were ravaged by fungi and she had to step in to stem out the disease. From an early age, my father had mango plantation, and this plantation was attacked by mushrooms. But at that time, we did not know it. And as years passed, there was a drop in production. And from then on, I wanted to know why these mangoes were being attacked by fungi, why production was falling. And it's since then that I devoted myself to it and that I love science. Ajata is one of the 20 laureates of the four women in science young talent prize from sub-Saharan Africa who will receive between $10,000 to $15,000 to help them in their work.